Oh, this is so freaking cool, man. My name is Burf and this is my turf. I'm straight out of the thrift store. Hey, what's up? It's your boy Burf and I'm back at Craptastic Sam's. And the reason I'm here is because I was here yesterday and when I purchased some bags that had some of these night looking figures in them. And one of them happened to be from 1988. It was a Lucasfilm, uh, it was from Lucasfilms. And uh, Lucas, let me back up, a Lucasfilm character made by Tonka. Turns out it's from the movie Willow. And I think, I think I saw other figures like it in other bags that I didn't get because it was like just one figure mixed in with a whole bunch of crap. Just like, just like we would expect, you know, at Craptastic Sam's. So I'm gonna head in here and see what kind of goodies they got. And maybe, just maybe, I can find the rest of these Willow figures. Let's head in there, keep our fingers crossed and pray. Pray, 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 pray. That the vintage thrift gods are good to me today. All right, what do we got in here? Oh, well, there's a TMNT. That's at least cool. I might get that bag just because of him. But I don't see any of those figures in here. Hey, check this out. Hot Wheels slot car track set. They only went 12 12 for it. And I saw it selling for between 30 and 40 bucks on eBay. Check this out. This is a 1994 Fisher Price Castle play set. Oh man, that thing looks so cool. And I'm just thinking about the dragons and the knights that I have and how awesome of a play set this would be for those. That would look pretty cool in the bunker. I think I'm gonna get it. They only want $4.94 for it. And I saw that it recently sold on eBay for $89. So how cool is that? And it didn't even have like the cannonballs and stuff. This thing's filled with like cannonballs and stuff. So, all right, I'm gonna snag it. All right, guys, well, I'm gonna pass on this just because mainly I don't wanna lug it home. It's pretty big. But if you want 12 12 for it, which I think is a good price, I could probably get 25 or 30 bucks out of it. But I just don't want to take the time today. I'm just not feeling it. So I'm going to leave it here for someone else to pick up. All right, guys. Well, we didn't find the Willow figures, which kind of sucks. I was really hoping that they were there. I could have swore. I could have swore to God I saw them in the bags, but you know, I don't know, maybe someone else picked them up or maybe they were never there to begin with. <laughs> but uh, we did get this Fisher Price Castle play set. We're gonna go hit up one more thrift store and then we're gonna head home and do a little show and tell because this thing's pretty badass. All right, my friends, we are here. <laughs> we are, we are at the thrift store. Whoops, that's family dollar. That's family dollar right there. We're at the thrift store. All right, let's head in here, see what kind of goodies they got. Let's keep our fingers crossed and pray that those vintage thrift store gods, right? Something like that. Let's pray that the thrift gods, let's pray that the vintage thrift gods are good to me today. All right, let's see, what do we got? We got a bag of cars. Looks like an Optimus Prime right there. And what's over here? We got a dinosaur, there's a Woody, some Space Jam stuff. And there's our friend Buzz Lightyear. Some sort of dinosaur and uh, more dinosaurs. And wow, lots of dinosaurs today. Here's a Brontosaurus. There's the Rex from Toy Story. Here's a T-Rex, another blue dinosaur. Hey, there's a Rescue Heroes guy. How much they want for the bag? Because I collect those, but I only collect ones I find in thrift stores. $3.93. Hmm, I'll think about it. And we got a little miniature Wally -E here. And there's a TMNT. Looks like a McDonald's toy. Oh, looky, looky. What do we got here? We got ourselves like a 12 inch, well actually that might even be 18 inches. An 18 inch Batman, that is pretty cool. 
And we've got a beast from Beauty and the Beast. He's kind of neat. I like that his face is actually, it's like rubber. It's like squishable, like a hard rubber. Not exactly plastic, but, and then he's got some fur. I think he might talk too, because it feels like he's got like a battery pack there in, in the middle of his uh, stomach. All right, what do we got here? Okay. That guy looks like he could be vintage. Hey, it's Tom Selleck. Actually, it looks like a miniature Rescue Heroes guy. And what do we have here? There's a core action figure. Let's see if we can kind of fish him out. Yeah. He's from the core. Looks like we got Finn from Adventure Time. Donald Duck. There's some dinosaurs. Oh, there's another Rescue Heroes. And we've got a Star Wars figure right here. Joker from Imaginext. Uh, there's a Batman from Imaginext as well. And some dinosaurs. Hey, there's a knight and his horse to go with my brand new castle playset. What else is in here? Yeah, there's Aladdin. Oh, there's the horse from Toy Story. And a Marvin the Martian. And what do we got here? I think this is like that chicken hawk dude from Foghorn Leghorn. And what's this thing? Looks like it might be some sort of bug. And there's a big green dinosaur, a Mickey Mouse, a horse. Oh, see that Spider-Man? I actually just sold that Spider-Man on Marketplace for 30 bucks. I bought him for $5 last year sometime and finally sold him. What's this thing? That's kind of crazy looking. It's probably one of those things that like blows bubbles or something. Now that is an old looking dinosaur. And I would be wrong on that. He's actually from 2015. I thought maybe he was like 90s or something. Now that is a nice looking plush tiger. Check that out. That thing is in really good shape. This looks like it could be a vintage Cabbage Patch. Yep, it sure is, 1982. They're not really worth a whole lot of money, so not really worth flipping. Plus they want like nine bucks for this guy. I'm gonna pass on him, because I already have a Cabbage Patch that I scored at Goodwill. That's in a lot better condition than this, but there's our vintage, 1982. All right guys, we got this Jax Pacific Batman from 2015. He is super dope. He's just gonna need a little cleaning up. But uh, let's head home and do a little show and tell. All right, guys, we're back at the bunker. So let's check out some of these cool thrift store finds that I scored today. All right, guys, first up, we have this 2015 Jax Pacific, the Batman. Oh, this thing is cool. He towers at about 18 inches, 18 to 20 inches. Here's his utility belt. He's got the emblem. His cape is in, is in good shape. It had, uh, I had to clean it up a little bit. It did have a, a couple of stains on it, but it came out. Those came out with just a little, a little wash with the washcloth. So, but yeah, this is a really awesome figure and it's gonna display really well here in the bunker. Up next, we have the prize of the day. Look at how freaking awesome this 1994 Fisher Price Castle playset is. Oh, this is so freaking cool, man. And I've got all of those figures that I found at Craptastic Sam's a little earlier, I think like a week ago or something. They go perfect with this playset. We got the Viking crew over here. I think they're Vikings, they look like Vikings. But, oh my gosh, like I'm so stoked. Here are some of the dragons that I recently found at the thrift store. If you recall, this was these were the dragons that I found along with the Vintage Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, April O'Neil and Ace Duck. So these dragons, again, just go perfect 
with this playset. I've got twin dragons over here. We've got two of these guys. And we got this green dragon. Oh, look how stunning that is. Isn't this cool? Oh my gosh, I'm so freaking jazzed up over this score. Oh man, I've got this cannon up here as well. So let me see if I can drop this. All right, now check this out. We're gonna fire this bad boy. Whoa. <laughs> oh man, and then this tower right here is literally filled from the bottom all the way. You can see there's a boulder behind this guy. They go all the way to the top. There's tons of different boulders in there. Oh, again, I, I'm so excited about this. I just think this thing is just the coolest playset ever. And I can't believe I got it for like, what was it like four or five bucks or something like that? Unbelievable score. Well, hey, I hope you enjoyed watching this content as much as I enjoyed making it for you. If you did do me a favor, smash that like button. That would really help me out big time, big time. Seriously, you don't know how much that like really helps my channel. So smash the like button for me and check out this next video. I know you're gonna love it.